Welcome, let's find that the domain here of f of x, y is given by the square root of x plus y plus 1 over x minus 1. So you have to apply the following basic conditions. The quantity there under the square root symbol has to be greater than or equal to 0. So you got to say that x plus y plus 1 has to be greater than or equal to 0. You can solve this for y. So for example, you can say y plus 1 for now is greater than or equal to negative x. And then from there, what you can do is you can subtract 1. So y is greater than or equal to negative x minus 1. So that's that part. However, there's one more condition here, which is, you see, on the bottom, if you plug in x equals 1, you would always be dividing by 0. So that means that the other condition is this one. x minus 1 here cannot be equal to 0. Add 1 to both sides. What that tells you is that x cannot be equal to positive 1. That's the domain. If you were to express this using set builder notation, you would say that the domain looks like this. Using set builder notation, curly braces, x comma y to indicate a point. Within here, you usually put a vertical bar that is read such that. So this is the set of all points x comma y such that following is true. y is greater than or equal to negative x minus 1 comma, and x here does not equal to positive 1. For those of you who are visual learners, it might help to build a picture, a small picture. So there is a basic coordinate system. Within here, you're going to place the line defined by y is greater than or equal to negative x minus 1. So that looks like this. And then what you would do is you would shade above it because you see it says greater than. So shade above that line. That would be the region where you would take values to be plugged into the function, this region right here. And one more thing that you have to indicate in here is that x, this part, x does not equal to 1. So you might do that by drawing a vertical line this way. And also because those values on x equals 1 are to be excluded, we can dash the line. So I'll dash it. So this line here is x equals positive 1 excluded from the domain. Any point on the line cannot be used in the domain. Any point in the rest of it, the shaded region there above the line and off x equals 1 can be used in the domain. Thanks so much. Please leave a like and subscribe. See you in another video.